Hey lovelies, how are you? It's me again, and again I'm here with an unboxing. I'm sorry I haven't done a lot of vlogging, I've just, one, for the past few days I've really been down, and two, I really don't know what to talk about. There's so many witchy channels out there that I really, I haven't found my niche, I guess, um, but I guess I'll find it sooner or later. So today, what I have is the Box of Shadows, goddess box this only comes once a year and it's during Samhain so this year um it's the first time I've ever gotten the Samhain goddess box so you guys it's insanely huge um I'm gonna remove my address from here and then just show you the difference in size so this is our typical supreme box right this is what we normally get this Mm, monster is the Samhain goddess box. Look at the difference in size. There. It's different. It's huge. So, I have no idea what to expect from this. I was not able to find any unboxing videos for last year's. I'm sorry, I keep adjusting myself. Um, I wasn't able to find any unboxing videos of last year. I wasn't really um, able to see other other year's boxes. So I have no idea what to expect in here. So I'm kind of excited, but I really, I've, I've not really been impressed with the past couple of months. Um, and I'm actually looking for possibly another witchy box of su subscription service, if I could get my words out. So if you have one that you particularly love, pop it in the comments. Um, and then I will see about subscribing to that one. So yeah, I don't do sponsored videos, not yet anyway. Hi. Um, but <laughs> yeah, I buy the boxes with my money. I don't, I'm not given anything. Um, like I said, I'm, I'm not doing sponsored videos. These are just my true reviews of how I feel about the boxes. So without further ado, the 2019 Samhain, that is my ring, which we just installed, and it's very sensitive, so it keeps going off. Um, this is our 2019 Box of Shadows Samhain Goddess Box. And, of course, I didn't think to bring scissors or anything over here, so I'm going to have to try and rip this open. Because it's sealed. Look at this. Look at this awesome kind of thing going on here. Oh, I think I might actually... No, I don't. It spoke too soon. Having nails doesn't help. Oh no! Sorry guys, I'm using my tablet and it doesn't stand up the right way. I had a feeling that was gonna happen. Let's try that again. Stay. All right, let's see. Can I get this? Let me back up a little bit. Maybe I won't shake the table. Again, half this video is gonna be me trying to open the box. Ha! I got it. Ooh, what's inside? All right, so, let's see. So we've got a little box, a little box, a little pamphlet. There's our box. I want to say this is probably going to tell us what's inside, and I don't. Nope. Yes, it does. No, I don't want to see. I don't want to see. Okay. So I don't want to be. I don't want to sneak peek. So here, you guys could see. Um, and let's see, this is not a beer. This is cream soda, by the way. I'm craving something sweet all day. All right, let's see. Whoa, that's a big candle. Oh, that's gorgeous. Okay, already I'm happy. Um, so every month with the monthly subscription box, we get a candle by Modern Magics. I wish I had one on hand to show you guys, but this is... The, the candle that we normally get is maybe that big. So, I mean, look at the size of this candle. This is just gorgeous. So it's going to be the same one I got with my October box. It's just much, much bigger. Look at that. Oh, so it smells so good. So it is pumpkin spice, but it has herbs that are... Let's see, hand poured in small batch and charged with intent for Samhain. Herbs purposely, purposefully selected to enhance divination and assist with slipping through the veil. 
So it's got fragrance oil, onyx stones, cloves, nettle, mugwort, rosemary, and allspice. So that is, I mean, the size of that candle. Hold on, one minute. Okay, so I stepped away for a minute because I wanted to actually show you the comparison in candles. I've never actually looked at their Etsy shop, so I don't know the price range these candles typically run. So this is the Samhain candle that came in my monthly subscription box. And this is the candle that came in the goddess box. You'll see there's a huge difference. Look at that. That's freaking awesome. That's definitely awesome. All right, so next thing, let's see. We see, I see something in bubble wrap. Oh my gosh. It's like Christmas every day, or Yule, I guess I should say. Why do I not bring scissors when I open these boxes? I should know better. Ah. All right, we're just gonna rip it open because it doesn't wanna open. Okay. It's a sphere of some kind, so, oh, it feels good. I'm trying to get it out, look at that. Come on! <laughs> Not funny! Get out! This is ridiculous, <laughs> you guys. Ah, oh, there it is. Oh, bubble wrap. Oh, why? I'm sorry. I keep adjusting myself. That is gorgeous. That is gorgeous. Look at that. Um, don't know what kind of stone it is. I'm not even gonna try and guess. I'm not amethyst. I recognize citrine. I recognize. Um, but some of the blacker stones. I mean, it could be onyx. It could be obsidian. Um but it's gorgeous. That is gorgeous. So let's, where can I put that? That it's not gonna roll over the place. Put it back in the box. All right, look. Oh my gosh. Because I need another journal. I totally need another journal. You guys. This is gorgeous. It is leather. A leather journal with cord. Has a triple moon on there and it is I'm gonna open it up it looks like a moonstone in the center of the moon the full moon in the middle okay come on. wow look at that okay and then it folds open And it's like handmade papers. That is definitely something I will use. This is one of those things you get and it's like, will I use it? I don't want to ruin it. <laughs> but I, th I, I already have an idea on what I'm going to use this for. This is, this is gorgeous. It's pretty awesome. That makes, that makes me happy. All right, next, Alchemy England. This is something my husband will probably steal. Oh, wow. So it's a necklace from Alchemy England, and it is a athame or sword, however you want to look at it. I'm going to leave it in the packaging. That is, that's awesome. I like that. An ath or yeah. Well, it's not really an athame. Athames tend to be double sided. This is more of um, just like a ritual knife. I wonder what it's made of. It might be bone of some sort, or knowing the witch's box, you know, and how they go. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna hold off on that one because I don't know what it's made of. Coffin nails. 
with instructions on how to use them. This I don't have any of in my um, in my space, so this is definitely something that I well I don't say. Try that again. I don't necessarily need it, but it's a good ritual tool to have. You know, if I've come to the point where I need something, um, I'd rather have it than have to go hunting for it in order to do my spell work. I'd rather have it on hand already. Oh, pretty. This is a gorgeous sun catcher. Look at this. This I would see more for the, um, like the summer sabbats then but I guess the colors are really kind of fallish I'm gonna try and pull this out because this is gorgeous there we go feels like glass it comes with a little suction cup so you can hang it on your window Come on, open. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? That is just, that's amazing. I'm in love with that. Now I'm actually trying to unbox it back up. I'm gonna leave it unboxed for now. Just kind of put that on the side in such a way that it won't fall and break. And then we've got a tapestry. What? Oh, pretty. Okay, it is a round tapestry, 60 inch diameter, 100% cotton made in India. That's what it looks like. That's awesome. So the pentacle is a sacred symbol. The circle is a symbolic of the wheel of life, the continuous flow of spiritual energy that binds all together. The four lower points of the star signify the elements, earth, water, fire, and air. The top point represents the divine. That is gorgeous. We need to find somewhere to put that. And that is the bottom of the box. I mean, I'm actually... I don't want to say impressed, but... Not disappointed. I'm I'm quite happy with everything that I've got in the box. Everything is useful. Um, I love my candle. I'm just gonna put that now. Where did I put that little card? Of course, it's gonna be under everything because that's how I do. Where did I put the card? You guys, seriously, what did I do? Okay. Anyway, so I'm pleasantly surprised. I guess you could say um, I'm happy with everything that was in the box. Um, this is, like I said, only once a year thing, the goddess box. It's gorgeous. Everything is useful. Everything will be used in my house. If I, if I don't find a use for it, someone in my coven might. You know, so, but I like that it's not all stuff that just is, I don't know how to use it, how to say it. Um, I guess extreme where you, you're, you'll you use it or you won't. Um, there's the England, the book. I'm trying to find that. There it is. Okay. Samhain Goddess Box. October 2019. Samhain Candle by Modern Magics. A huge one compared to our regular monthly boxes. Nine inch, okay, so it's acrylic, which is surprising because typically they do, um, but again, this is more something I would see with a litha box being a summer because um, litha has to do with the fey and you can't use metal or specifically iron when it comes to working fey magic, which would be around litha. So this is something that I would see useful more around litha. Um, not that it's a bad thing. It's probably definitely something that I would use but but yeah so an acrylic athame coffin nails selenite or obsidian divination ball so we got obsidian so we got an obsidian divination ball hand of Macbeth athame pendant that is the alchemy England 
pendant. Let's show that again because that's just freaking awesome. Um, the glass sun catcher, the round cotton tapestry, and the embossed leather journal. This, while it's not a long list, it's things that I think I totally got my money's worth. Some things in here I would not buy, but that's why I like the boxes because they're not things that I would just go into a new age or a cult shop and be like, I'm going to buy this. This is stuff that you don't think to buy or things that you look at. It was like, oh, I like that, but no, do I really want to buy it? And then you get it in a box. And it's like, I totally need that. <laughs> or I will totally hang that, you know, in my altar room on my window, the sun catcher. Um, or the candles, you know, we could totally burn these um, during Samhain. So, yeah, I am definitely pleasantly surprised with this box. So, maybe we've got one more month of the Box of Shadows uh, Supreme box. So, we will get the November box. And then beyond that, we're really going to see what the November box looks like and if we want to keep it or not. Um, but yeah, if you guys have a favorite subscription box um, of Witchy Orient or Occult or Neo-Pagan or New Age, what have you. If you have a favorite subscription box or a subscription box that you've looked at and be like, this would be cool, but I don't want to get it without knowing what's inside. Pop a link below or pop a description below and I will see, I'll talk to my husband and we'll see about getting a subscription box or two. Maybe we'll switch it up every month. We'll do something different. Um, so you guys could see what these companies are offering us, what what these companies, you know, are, are sending with their subscription boxes. But I am looking for another one. So my Wizarding World, Loot Crate has gone through a little bit of an upheaval. So... I'm pending on waiting on my uh, Wizarding World box. I don't know how that's going to look with the recent upheaval with Loot Crate. But um, I'm thinking of switching off Box of Shadows. And like I said, please, you know, put your links below. Put your favorite boxes below and I'll, I'll check them out. But yeah, thank you guys for checking out the video. Um, I look forward to the next one. Love you guys.